But he did some resurrection from those that had died. Who did resurrection? Jesus Christ. That he wanted. Jesus didn't do any resurrection, sir. That's why I was telling you, do you read them Bibles that you have right there? Yeah. Okay. Let me put you, and I got this on record, too. Uh, okay, now open it up and let me show you something right quick, okay? And do you do believe like in Jehovah, right? The creator? Yeah. Okay. Let's look at his words. Because you open it up and turn it to Isaiah chapter 43. You open yours up too, sir, so uh, you can get your understanding. Because this thing is serious. And our people are going through some serious oppression because of this idol that's called Jesus. Mm. Isaiah chapter 43. Oh, yeah, Jesus, that's what the, that's what that's what Jehovah says. If y'all call Jehovah, y'all says that. Isaiah forty three. Turn to verse ten. Start at verse ten. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get you to read that. See, you are my witness, declares Jehovah. Yes, my servant, whom I have chosen, so that you may know and have faith in me, and understand that I am the same one before me. No God was born, and after me there had been none. I am Jehovah. Besides me, there's no Savior. Did you hear that, sir? Mm -hmm. Okay, so do you believe that to be correct? Sure. All right, so uh, who is this uh, Jesus guy? You got to he sent to the earth. No, he didn't. No, that's not true. Again, let's turn to Exodus chapter 4 and verse 22 and listen to the words of who you call Jehovah. Exodus chapter 4, verse 22. Hey, and you do believe Jesus is the only begotten son, right? Yes. Okay. You, you say you believe that too. Now let's listen to the words of the creator of all things. Mm -hmm. The creator of the heavens and the earth. Exodus 4, chapter 22. I mean, verse 22. Read it. So you must say to Pharaoh, this is what Jehovah said, Israel is my son. Read it. My firstborn. Even my firstborn. Yeah. Who is his son? Israel. And his what? No, no, he said Israel. He didn't say Jesus. He said Israel is his son, even his firstborn. Now, let me explain that to you. Israel is a nation of people. That's what he was talking about. Yeah, a nation of, uh, exactly. That's who, but he said that was his firstborn son. So if Israel is the firstborn son, how can Jesus be the only begotten son? No, he just said that in Isaiah 43 that he was only before him there was no God and neither would there be a God after him. And he said besides him there's no Savior. Your, your partner just read that. So you must understand that he cannot lie in his